quite a situation as we now know it on the island of Grenada. It has been inv invaded by a multinational force, as it's being described. The bulk of that force, about 1,800 American troops, that includes Marines and, and apparently airborne troops as well. Hey guys, welcome to the Gear Locker. Today we're going to be taking a look at my good friend's 82nd Airborne Impression Kit from the mid-1980s. The uniform used is a Type 2 BDU jacket and Type 1 BDU pants, both in the hot weather 100% cotton ripstop variant that was introduced in 1985. The boots are 80s dated Type 3 Panama Soul jungle boots, and he's added some 82nd Airborne insignia. Webbing is 80s dated Alice equipment. This includes two compass pouches, two magazine pouches, and two canteen pouches as well as the butt pack. Speaking of which, he's made a modification that replaced the black metal clips on the suspenders to paracord which was seen in some pictures. This makes it a lot more comfortable to wear when with a rucksack. The rifle is the M16A1, which was introduced very early on in the 60s, but was used up until the mid-1980s. The helmet is a PASGT with a homemade ragtop scrim cover. This was a very common modification made from BDU scraps, which became more popular with troops during the invasion of Panama. The rucksack is an LC1 large Alice pack that is set up in an airborne configuration with an e-tool and two quart canteen. While this kit is functional, there are of course some details that he would like to add or change to make it more accurate. Regardless, thank you guys for checking out this video. We hope you enjoyed it. Don't invade Granada or Panama and we'll see you in the next one.